December is a time to celebrate the holidays. Reflect before the new year set in and spend time with our loved ones. Unfortunately, that does not apply to our hero of today's story. We are here to tell you the tale of the biggest grump on Christmas in the form of a well-known Christmas stories by Charles Dickens. And who is our 2023 grump? Well, it's none other than Yori Yagami. Another holiday. Another year he isn't dead. Sorry, folks. We couldn't get him to say humbug. Every December the 12th is the birthday of his most hated rival, Kyo Kusanagi. Every year, Yori would spend the day cursing the name of Kyo and avoiding Kyo and his friends altogether. Not for his own sake, but because he hated Kyo too much to even enjoy the holidays at all. Which, in short, killed his Christmas spirit. Bah! Nonsense. He still lives. He really won't say it. He'll get what's coming to him, folks. <laughs> I'm not for a reminder of the month my enemy was born, nor am I in any Christmas spirit. What? Yori-san, happy holidays! Every year with this one. You do one nice thing for someone, and they make you their friend. Then they're showing up every December saying, Don't kill my boyfriend! It's so freaking annoying. Makes me want to butcher Billy and E.G. again. Or maybe slice up Vice and Mature, for old time's sake. Aww. <laughs> I know you and Kyo don't get along, but Chizuru-san says you're not all bad. Every December, you completely avoid Kyo and company. But nobody should spend Christmas alone. I like my personal space, Kushinata, especially around the holidays. It's getting late. Go home before Kyo gets the wrong ideas. Yori-san. <laughs> you care about us. What else do you want? Here. Now don't open it till tomorrow. It's from Chizuru's son and me. Whatever. Bye bye, Yagami san. Mata ne.
Next year for sure, you'll meet your end, Kyo. What in the... You've got to be kidding. Hello, Iori. I, Dio, am a ghost. Dio? Like Ronnie James Dio? Oh, gee, haven't I heard that one before? I, Dio, here came to warn you that you will be visited by three others outside your universe. Stop, 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 stop. You can't be serious. This is getting too bizarre. I am serious, you edgy little git. I get a few minutes out of hell to warn you about three others coming to teach you. The true meaning of Christmas. Keep the spirit of Christmas. Blah, blah, blah. I read that book. And I'm not buying it, Blondie. Now go haunt another apartment before I call an exorcist. If I wasn't already dead, I set you straight. But I, Dio, did my part. Now, wake up. was a dream? I haven't had warm tea in ages. The one time I decide to, I have a weird dream. I need some water. Here you go, sir. Thank you. I- Who are you? How did you get in here? Duh! Yelling! I come in peace! Calm down. She's only a child. The name's Ruby Rose, Huntress of Beacon Academy, leader of Team Ruby. Team Ruby. I don't remember that team name from the KOF. Oh crap, that wasn't a dream. You're from another universe, aren't you? Yep, here to teach you the true meaning of Christmas. But first, I have to get one thing out of my system. I love your outfit! Team Red and Black Scheme, high five! <sighs> Calm yourself. She's just a child. But jeez! I thought the girls from the KOF were annoying. This one is so much worse. Come on, don't leave me hanging! <laughs> Yay! Let's go! Let's see. The first ghost showed Scrooge his past. So that makes you. I'm not a ghost, silly. But I am gonna show you your past. Hang on. <laughs> Again. Okay. We're in the most erratic, unpredictable, and ancient of times. The 90s. The fashions, the trends, the snacks, the time forgot. Oh my! Why are we in the 90s? 1994 to be exact. Look, there's you over there. I remember this day. It was a few months after Kyo's first KOF. It was December. I... I was making my plans to join the Falling Years King of Fighters. It's at this point in time your spirit in Christmas died. But I have to ask, why are your legs tied together? It was a style. If you say so. You didn't wear that for a whole decade, did you? The point, child! Ah, yelling! Okay, okay! Oh, Licky, a random stranger approached you and... I remember that guy. That thug was working for Geese Howard. 
You could have went easy on the poor fellow. He was one of Geese's thugs. I left him breathing. He mentioned Billy Kane. So I dragged him back before his boss. <laughs> he and the ninja were surprised to see me. I mentioned the next King of Fighters. And the rest was history. Not quite. This was the start of the problem. Every year from here out, you obsessed over killing your rival Kyo Kusanagi. Every December was just another month for you to be glum and angry. Kind of sad, really. I don't need your pity. Girl, I'm so edgy. I am the knight. Poor, poor me. Listen, I get the whole dark goth character trope, but don't be so dismissive of other people who care about you. I think it was nice that one girl checked up on you. Next you're gonna show me the ones who give a crap about me? Oh, that's not my job. Time to wake up! <laughs> okay. That was a dream! This is turning into that one movie I heard about. Inception, mate. Well, see, you better just suck. Only thing good in here is the cola. And it's warm! How did you get here? I... Don't tell me, don't tell me. I really don't think I want to know. What if you busted my door or windows? You're buying me a new one! Wave it, sunshine. I'm here to show you what happened last Christmas. I'll just get this over with. Not even going to introduce yourself. John Constantine. Now that we're done for Maltese, let's go. I could have sworn the second one was supposed to be jolly. This is getting bizarre. I blame the blonde vampire. You know what, painfully jolly, mate? Watch Elf. Now stop being a bloody stick up my ass and let's go. It's bad enough I got pulled from the multiverse to teach a hot topic git in the meaning of Christmas. But he doesn't even have a good supply of booze. I don't drink, you rude little- That explains a lot. Now, let's go. Welcome to Christmas Day, in 2022. I don't know this house. Wait a minute. The Ice Girl. I know whose home this is. Merry Christmas, kiddo! Whatever. <laughs> it's better than your usual <laughs> response. I don't like the holidays, but I can't say I hate it either. Because you got the people who matter to you. Me, Kula, Whip, Foxy, Diana, I think. Max, I'm perfectly fine with Kay. You're the one who's in question. What are you talking about? The kid and I have stuck through thick and thin since Nest. Why wouldn't we be cool? <sighs> and thus ends another episode of Max Missing the Point. She's got you there, partner. No, she just wants to get on my nerves. It's been ten minutes since the last time she annoyed me. Lucky for her, I'm in a good mood. Why am I seeing these fools? Hey kid, what's on your mind? Yagami. Ugh. Don't mention that creep. Seriously, that's a mood killer. Hear me out. The guy once told me something. I hate not you, just the fact that you carry the blood of my enemy. He said that to me around the time we were dealing with Nest. He and Keo did help you and Kula stop Ignis. It's troublesome to call someone like that a comrade. But I can't call him an enemy either. Oh, would you look at that? Someone actually gives a crap about you. All the times I faced him in the KOF, I hated him the least. But like he said, neither enemy nor friend. But it was never personal. Well, biker boy and huge jacked man had a few words about you that needed to be heard. Cute. Now will you go away? Eh, not likely. We 
they got someone else to see. This is where Chizuru resigns. Happy holidays, Chizuru's son! Oh, Shingo. What brings you here? I heard there was going to be a party at Kyo's home. Seishu-san sent me to see if you'd make it. I still have my shrine's duties to attend. I'll have to see to that first. Okay. Also, could you take a look at this? Where did you find this? After a psycho and a Captain Kurt mask tried to kill me, Kinzo, and Dan, I found it on the ground. I said some words, and it reacted! What words? Um, something along the lines of, I wish Iori would have a taste of my luck? <laughs> that little Kusanagi fanboy! I'll kill him! Unlikely. He did this but we ain't here for him. Well, I have been working on a brand new attack. And I need a guinea pig. Hmm. Leave it with me. I'll see what I can do. Also, tell Kyo maybe. Okay! Merry Christmas, Chizuru-san. Merry Christmas, Shingo. <sighs> Yori, you're most likely alone this Christmas. You and Kyo may be rivals, but you're both honorable comrades to me. At least one holiday, I'll... Come to think of it, what do you get a guy like that? <laughs> you owe me nothing, woman. Oh, do share with the class the bug up your arse about her. Or do you just not like women? It's not like that, you British wanker! After the battle with Orochi, Neskoons took Kyo. I tried to stop them, but I was too weak from the battle and blacked out! Chizuru nursed me back to health. Since then... I've owed her a debt. And it looks like despite your Usage charming attitude, she still gives a crap about you, mate. Even so, she has enough people who care for her. I'm an afterthought compared to the others. Boy, this guy... Look, mate, you're a tad too young for pointless grudges and long behavior. I get the world ain't sunshine and rainbows, but not showing gratitude to those who matter to you are painful consequences, mate. Every chance I get, I'd let Z know what she means to me. Z? I said too much, mate. Oh, and um, good luck with the third guy. The Agamnidus. What? That's it? Yeah, this is the part where you wake up. <clears throat> oh, no, not again! Two down, one to go. You can come out now! Huh? Maybe now I've stopped dreaming. Huh? I've spoken too soon. Iori. Yagami. You. I've seen you before. Sometimes at the KOF. Other times at theme parks. Are you here to show me my future? Are you the third one I was warned of? Why yes, Mr. Yagami. I'm the ghost of Christmas. Kick your ass! Oh no! No 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 no! 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 Oh yes, I'm back. For many reasons. Screw it! I'm gonna do what I should have done! Two ghosts to go! Take this! Flames. Oh hell, not again! It's the Tales of Ash all over again for you, pal! Like it or not, I'm gonna show you your bad ending path. Then I get my Christmas present! Oh hey! I got a special present for you good little boys and girls at home! After the credits! Who are you talking to?! Oh right, uh, hang on. These flash forwards can be killers. What happened? 
Oh, you don't live here anymore. But why are that girl and K49 here? Bruh, it's Cronin now. After all the work to get him back, you could at least get his name right. But the biggest question in the Unverse right now is how an angry little sh** got on Mamacita like her. That is a mystery. Mitsunote must formulate plans to steal Hottie away from walking Akita reference. Cut it But where am I? Oh, we'll get to that soon. But first, enjoy the transition. Yes! Give you! What happened to you? Oh, Kay? No family. Whip and the others are gone. Underneath all that edginess, Kay really cared about his friends and family. Until one bad day. All gone in one swoop. Whose grave is that? No. It couldn't be. <laughs> Thanks to you, I. I have nothing. Asshole! Something's not right. My vendetta was with Kusanagi. Why did he suffer? Collateral damage of an accident that had something to do with you. What happened? <sighs> okay, pal. But be warned, you're not gonna like what you see. Be gone, evil, evil, be gone. I rebuke thee, be gone. Jizuru. That stone. Yeah, about that stone. It's called the Stone of Secret Fire. Inside it was a djinn. Basically a genie from hell. A certain schoolgirl made a wish on it for you. I think it was, I wish Iori would be at peace. And well, <laughs> that's what you wish for. She killed me. Worse! Every person you ever loathed or hated are gone. Infinity Gauntlet style, baby. Dip, dip, dip. Another one bites the dust. And another one gone, and another one gone, another one bites the dust. Ah! No. No! That would mean... Case family, gone. Shingo and crew, gone. Kyo Kusanagi, gone! When the Jewel responded to Yuki's wish, it spared everyone you hated the least. However, Cheesy here went mad from the events, and now she spends her days warding off this Jewel's evil spirit. Ooh! Let me join in on the chat! Ooga chaka, ooga chaka, ooga, 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 ooga! Mama say, mama sa, mama kusa! Mama say, mama sa, mama kusa! No. I never wanted this on her. And I never killed Kyo. Oh, is that all you care about? Screw it. Last stop, pal. Damn it! Stop doing that! <laughs> this grave. What is this? You said the jewel spared the user. Then why is she? Why is she? Oh, it did. But the ordeal traumatized her the hardest. First grief. Then she stopped eating. Never left her room. Stop it. She said she didn't want to live in a world without Kyo. Sound familiar? Why didn't I do something? Your peace was short-lived anyway. The Orochi curse took its toll on you months later. On... Uh, hold up. Hmm. Christmas Day. Irony. I... 
never wanted any of this. She came up with living the same way my father did. No, oh, you want to be a little less of a dick around the holidays? Why do you mock me? Mock you? Dude, I ain't asking you to give up your rivalry. Just stop being a sourpuss around the holidays. It'd be a good start to avoid all this. But how? How do I start? It's been too long since I've had any Christmas spirit. Not since before 94. There's one thing you can do as a start. You can wake up. Grab a brush and put on a little makeup. Hide the scars to fade away the shakeup. Why do you leave the keys up on the table? There you go, create another the fable. Yeah, you wanted to. Okay, bro, seriously. WAKE UP! <laughs> Kidding me? Wait, I need to be sure. <laughs> you boy, what day is it? Who the hell you calling boy, you honky motherfucker? I think he was talking to me, sir. It's Christmas Day. Heavy, I know you haven't been in KOF for a while, but don't let it make you bitter. Easy for you to say, little man. You've been in like three. I don't like to talk about Louise. Well, maybe you want to talk about that hot pirate lady that's always with you. <laughs> I mean, damn. Hey, watch it. Perhaps I should change my ways for the holidays. This book. I've wanted this for a while. Few notes I'd like to practice on my guitar. Aw, that's so sweet! You should go thank those two for going through the trouble. I should. I. Duh! What in the. No, 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 no! I'm still dreaming! Oh no, you're awake. That must have been some trippy tea you had. Tea? I... Wait a minute. Yep, that green tea you had before bed? I put a little flavor into it. <laughs> you drugged me! Oh, that's, a, that's just a nasty word. More like I enlightened your team with a little something I snatched from Doctor Strange when he wasn't looking. You were tripping balls, bro! You little... Wait a minute. My flames. So I am awake. You should go do that thing you were thinking about doing. I should. I mean, like now! I want to enjoy my Christmas present. What in the hell are you two doing here? Let's just say being on the naughty list has its benefits. Now beat it! Santa's presents aren't the only thing getting out wrapped today. Yeah, that's my best Billy D. Williams impression. It's all for you, babes. You can't kick me out of my own apartment! Dude, stop being a cock block! Ah, screw it. Does he do that? Uh, you movie sucked, by the way! Yori, how did you get here? Are you hurt? Annoyed, but okay. But not annoyed by you. Did, did he just say something nice to me? This is new. The gift you and the Kushinata gave me. Thank you. You came all this way to thank me? Many times, I guess you many have a heart ways. after all. Merry Christmas! Ah! Yagami! Where'd you come from? You! Uh oh. You're pissed. <sighs> Chizuru, did this twerp give you a jewel? Yes, last year actually. Give it to me. Here you are. How do you know of this? Unimportant. And trust me, I'm doing you a favor. Hey! Why'd you do that? You're better off not fooling with that jewel. Call this my thank you for the gift, Kagura. Oh, that? I take it you enjoyed your gift. Indeed. Don't ignore me! 
Why did you do that? And you! The next time you, Dan, and that other dork find some strange object on the ground, don't pick it up! Got it? Yes, I, I, I got it. Uh, please don't hit me. Uh, and his name's Kinzo. Who? Kinzo! You know who he is. You beat him in every KOF you participate in. You even stole his girlfriend from him! No. Doesn't ring a bell. What? Aren't you going to pick it up? No. I better not. Now if you excuse me, I have a long walk back to my apartment. Not so fast, Iori. There's one other person you should thank. Happy holidays, Yagami-san! <sighs> Kushinara. That book was very expensive. The least you could do is thank us both. <sighs> thank you. Eh? Thank you! Aww. You're welcome, Yagami-san. I've got a long way to go. And hopefully that red tool will be gone by the time I make it back. Red tool? Oh no. Don't ask. Merry Christmas, fools. I wonder what changed him. Hmm. He seemed a bit changed. Normally, he's elsewhere around the holiday season. He seemed really shook up about that jewel I found last year. So much so, he tossed it Lord knows where! Eh? That's weird even for Yagami. Oh well. There was something evil about that gem. Maybe this is for the best. From here on out, I'll do as many good deeds every December as I can. Practice a few Christmas tunes on the guitar. And buy more locks from my apartment. And so, Yuri Yagami, who couldn't admit it out loud, had his Christmas spirit somewhat restored. And what did he learn? That even when you're having a hard time around the holiday seasons, there are still those who would take the time to care and give a little. And that is what the holidays are really about. Giving.
Hey! You stayed! You're probably wondering, why have I been popping up as of late? Well, about that. Remember Capcom vs. SNK Salvation? Well, uh, sorry. No sequel. I hey, hey, hey! Turn that back on! As I was saying, there's somewhat of another series in the works. And I can't say too much, but let's just say the old script production team wants to take you for a ride. I want to take you for a Deadpool! Ugh, you and all of you people, enough with your wisecracks and get us out of here! If, if you, you keep, keep this, this up, up any longer, I swear, swear to the Lord of all world, I'm, I'm going, going to ruin, ruin you. you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've said too much. See you next year. And no, next year isn't the release date. It'll happen when it happens. But we'll bring you up to speed at some point. Be quiet!